so this uh, sort of we're accumulating the data. So there is data to support uh, usage of multiple uh, PARP inhibitors in the same patients uh, sequentially. Uh, again, there's not a, not a lot of data, but many of us have been using it and we have been seeing responses. Um, and because of the bioavailability of PARP and kinetics uh, between different uh, PARP inhibitors are, are somewhat different, uh, there may be an application of that type of sequential usage, maybe in, in combination with uh, uh, bevacizumabs and the combination of uh, PDL, PDL inhibition. Uh, we are um, currently there are num number of ongoing trials uh, looking in in this specific uh, this specific question of using of reusing PARP inhibitors uh, in patients who have been previously exposed to them in upfront setting. Uh, 